As chair of the Harold Ramis Film School at Second City, I'm particularly delighted this evening to be giving an award in comedic storytelling, um, something that seems an essential art form these days. And um, thanks, IndieWire, for having us come and, and deliver this award. From Chaplin to the Marx Brothers, from Second City to Saturday Night Live and Jon Stewart, comedy has often been the um, place to look for the real truths out in the world. I don't know about you, but I'm much more comfortable getting my nightly bad news from Trevor Noah and Samantha Bee than from uh, Wolf Blitzer. Um, I, I would say that as an industry and as a society, um, we desperately need to celebrate and honor um, comedic artists who, in my mind, are everywhere bit, uh, are equally important as the greatest dramatic storytellers. I admire Leo Tolstoy. He was one hell of a writer, not that funny. Um, and lest you think I'm suggesting that comedy needs to be satirical or political, not at all. Flat out silly and hilarious, equally important art form, and one that also helps us retain our collective sanity. Great comedians make humor look effortless, so much so that people often think um, it's a natural gift but in fact, it's the result quite often of painstaking comedic writing. Uh, indeed, comic storytelling is a craft essentially um, in the hands of writers and um, again, a reason why I'm excited to be giving this award to um, the person we're giving it tonight. Um, do you guys know who Harold Ramis is? Um, so I suspect he's been an inspiration to some of you here tonight, to me personally. Um, he was a great friend and collaborator. Uh, I started my humble career as the gopher in Caddyshack, um, went on to be Harold's gopher, um, and uh, was his par producing partner for over 20 years. In many ways, working next to Harold for all those years was the best education a comedy filmmaker could ever get. It was Harold who encouraged me to read, um, told me to check out Aristophanes and Shakespeare's comedies, watch Preston Sturgis, Watch the Marx Brothers dive into Dorothy Parker and S.J. Perlman, and I guess I could actually say I was the first graduate of the Harold Ramis Film School. Um, therefore, I am so pleased tonight um, to be presenting the first ever Harold Ramis Film School Comedic Storyteller of the Year Award to someone who's an inspiration to a generation of storytellers. With a great passion for honesty, a willingness to take chances, um, she and her partner decided not to wait for someone to let them create, but to go ahead and do it. With a great sense of adventure and courage, the show Broad City was created by one of these women. And the rest is history. Um, I give you writer, actor, director, illustrator, most recently host of a fabulous podcast, which I've been listening to in the car, called A Piece of Work, Abby Jacobson. Incredible, what? I haven't gotten an award ever. <laughs> so this is, I mean, anything that has any affiliation with Howard Ramis is really just incredible. And, and so um, my parents would be extremely proud of this, as am I. So um, thank you, IndieWire. Thank you guys, um, everyone at Second City. Um, anyone that watches the show, thank you. <laughs>